If you wear makeup, watch. Change your whole routine and try this instead. Moisturize first. Then after moisturizing, take some translucent powder. I usually use the Fit Me one, and I just lightly dab it all over my face. Not too much. Then take some setting spray. It could be any setting spray. I usually use the NYX one. After the setting spray, take a primer and just put your primer. Also, wait for the setting spray to dry first. Then just put on your foundation and just see what happens and how amazing your fucking makeup is going to look. And it's going to stay on 24-7 and it's not going to crease. Little tip for those of you guys who want to learn how to nose contour, uh, grab yourself one of these brushes. Go from the inner corner of your brow all the way down to the bottom of your nose. Apply a little bit to the tip to shorten it and repeat the same step onto the other side. Model makeup hack! Instead of spending money on an expensive color corrector, go to a drugstore and buy an orange lipstick. Blend! Finish your makeup and your eye bags will literally be non-existent. <laughs> So you know that you should be wearing SPF every single day and that you need to apply it every two hours. So keep one of these in your bag. So this is a mineral sunscreen and the best part about this is that you can actually dust it all over your face to reapply after your makeup is already on. They recommend that you wait 15 minutes before you go out into the sun. I am literally stocking up on this because I have never in my life experienced something that actually blurs everything on your freaking face. Like where is my nose? I didn't wear any makeup today. I only wore this. No joke. I'm going to show you how to cover up a pimple that's trying to take over your entire face. Before we begin, yes it is a pimple, it is not a cold sore. Thank you so much in the comments. So first take your foundation and start packing it on. I mean like pack it with your finger. Then you can kind of blend out the edges. Then take some loose powder on a beauty blender and really pack it on top. Just on where the pimple is. Okay. Dust it off. Layer one is now complete. Think of this like spackling. Go in with the second layer of your foundation, really packing it on. Same thing, blend out the edges. And set again. Now taking as concealer the same shade as your skin tone, do the same thing. Try and be really concentrated on top of that pimple. And of course set again. And there you have it. It's covered up. Well, as covered up as it's gonna get. Now do the rest of your makeup so you don't look so crazy. Okay, bye. Can't get that last little bit of makeup out of the bottom of that container? Just wait, don't throw it out. Find a sharp little tool, run it across the edges, pop open the back. You'd be surprised by how much is still in there. Oh, hi. Do you have a face full of acne and you just can't seem to figure out how to cover it up? Watch this. I've been able to trick people into thinking I have no acne at all with these three products. First, Exuviance Radiance Serum. This stuff is sticky as hell, and that's what you need for your foundation to stick. Next, Milk Hydro Grip Primer. This stuff is the bomb. And third, the NARS Matte Concealer and a concealer brush. Now watch this. Apply the serum, apply the primer. Take your concealer brush with the concealer and cover up all the acne. Now, this might just be the most important part. Once you have the concealer on, don't touch it, don't blend it, leave it alone for two minutes, and then apply your foundation. And here's the final look. Oh, I'm sorry, what? What acne? I can't, uh, what? <laughs>